Hi, this is Andy Gilman in Washington. Most people know me as a crisis communications expert and a media trainer. Well, today I'm speaking in another role as a member of the silent minority in the United States, people with replacement body parts for hips, knees, and ankles. You see, this TSA scanner controversy affects a lot of people, but us more than anybody else. For us, you either get the full body scan or you wait in line to get the TSA massage. Now let's think about it. If you've got a replacement hip, knee, or ankle, you're going to set off the alarm. And then while you're waiting for 10 to 12 minutes for somebody to come over to you, everybody else has gone through the line, picked up their belongings, and moved on. Now, I fly a lot. For me, like George Clooney in Up in the Air when he explained to his associate that, hey, if you want to wait for a bag, it's 17 minutes per flight, add that all up, it's years off your life. Well, for me, maybe not quite as long, but maybe months off my life. So for us, the TSA, full body scan, is freedom. We get in and out quickly. We're the silent minority, and we actually like these devices.